Today on the Cabela Saltwater Series, we're in San Juan, Puerto Rico, fishing for tarpon. Where he goes! <laughs> Join us as we meet up with brothers Armando and Kareem Char of Magic Tarpon Charters, as well as a few friends in the hidden mangroves and glassy lagoons of San Juan. Mighty tarpon! <laughs> Hey, welcome to the Cabela Saltwater Series. We're catching tarpon in Puerto Rico. Stay with us, we're gonna have an awesome show. Welcome to the Cabela Saltwater Series Fishing Show home of some of the hottest fish in action on the coast. With your host, Scott Simmons and Jim Elrod, join us as we cover the Cabela's Redfish Series tournaments and fish with some of the top saltwater anglers. The Saltwater Series is sponsored by Cabela's, the world's foremost outfitters. Mayak Boats, leaving the competition behind. Cresta's Boats and Motors. Port Aransas Chamber of Commerce. The Brazos Sport Convention and Visitors Council. Evan Rudy Tech. Laguna Rods. Wade Wright. Power Pole. Tejano Salsa. And these fine sponsors. It was a still November morning when we met up with Captain Armando of Magic Tarpon Charters. We set out through a maze of canals and tunnels which led us right through the daily hustle and bustle of the city of San Juan. As we watched people rush into their next appointment, their jobs, their everyday lives, we eased underneath them through the small creeks. As we watched, we slowly disappeared into the tall mangroves as if we were miles from civilization. We eased into a glassy lagoon and soon noticed Nervous bait jumping everywhere and hungry tarpon busting the surface. It's going to jump as soon as they hit it. Usually, they, they, it's, going, it's going to jump. Okay. So pay attention for that. There's definitely a te technique to catching these tarpon. Yeah, and uh, this is my first line out, so let's hope I do it right. We bow to the king, is what we're told. Lean forward, get him slack when he jumps up in the air. Now sideways and watch out he jumps. All right, Larry. Oh, oh, oh. I've got a uh, fish on here, buddy. It's getting exciting now. What do I do next? Now, just bring him in. Yeah, just bring it in. Just pull. Well, you have to just pull, and then you go down your reel. Okay. And watch out because he's coming quickly, but he's not done yet. Watch out, he can. He's not done yet. Not huh? done yet. Come this way. Try to go forward. You want to stand up next to him? So be. Here. Let me have the leader here. Watch out, he's not done yet. So. He's not done yet. Oh, yeah, he's taking land. Yeah. He's oh, it's all the boat. All right, let's pull. Real? Somebody's going to get tired. Somebody's going to get tired. Check him out, man. Uh, 80 pounder, you can hook it over here also. Yeah, this morning we're just going for I can't imagine an 80-pounder. Go, <laughs> baby. This morning we're going for junior tarpon. This afternoon the tide comes in. We, we go, go for, for the big guy. Go guys. for the big yeah. one. Look at this, Rick. Look at this, Rick. Fish on. Fish on. Boy, it feels time. Go, Jim. Go. He's coming straight in. Yeah, keep, stand up in the front. Okay, watch out. He's got to jump out. Bow. Okay, shoot him. <laughs> lean, <laughs> lean, <laughs> bow, bow. Yeah, it's hard to do it, ain't it? <laughs> yeah. Remember to do that. Uh -huh. You can see when he's gonna go up though. That line starts yeah. peeling, peeling out on you. You can you can put it now sideways. You can fight the fish sideways. Okay. He's a little bit smaller than the one Larry yeah. had. Mm -hmm. 
He's a good starter fish for me. He's about the same size as mine? Bring it here. Watch out, he's not done yet, okay? Okay. Boat, boat. Whoa. Nice boat. Yeah, another four pounder probably, huh? Mm -hmm. Bring it in here. Keep that real close to you, he says, and then when he jumps, you bow to him and yep. give him slack. Watch out, he's throwing that hook. Ooh, he did, boy. <laughs> he took off again. Boy, I couldn't imagine a big old 80 pounder on here. I'm telling you. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, ho! <laughs> got it right in the corner. Perfectly hooked. Perfectly hooked. Look at that. Perfect Beautiful guy. fish. Swallow that one now. Alright. Check it out, my first Puerto Rican tarpon. My first tarpon. This is an awesome experience. We're gonna get them only bigger today, so get ready for this. Five tiny size. Oh man, let's do it. 25 feet of water. Jim and Larry just hooked the tarpon, now it's my turn. I'm tired of watching. Alright, here we go. Good. Mouth, mouth. Good him forward. Fish on. Fish on, and I just did two things wrong. Alright. <laughs> now that's a little guy right here. Alright. Look at that, he's already in. Man, that looks like a giant shad. <laughs> so all you do is you keep that rod straight at him and you kind of work him. Like, I'm yeah. gonna pull this way so I can wear him out a little bit without yeah. letting that hook. But as soon as he comes top and jumps, I gotta give slack on that line. So see what I'm doing? Kind of like you'd do it a redfish, you're trying to get him worn out a little bit, and I'm just kind of pulling against his head. Thank you, Captain Armando, off of my first tarpon. Yeah, he did pretty good. He did very, very well. Now let's see who's out, how he can handle a big tarpon. There's four of us in the boat. Four of us have hooked up. We're gonna start moving a little bit towards bigger and then bigger and bigger. But to be honest with you, I don't really care. I just, I love this. We can go catch those five, six pounders all day. Sure. All right, Armando, stop number four. What are we looking for now? Well, over here, that's Torresillas Lagoon. We're going to be fishing for the big tarpon again. Last try, see what happens today. And uh, that bait in the bottom, and cross our fingers, and let's do it. All I'm right. I'm sweating. Yes, I want to work up sweat. <laughs> Although I'm enjoying it so much, the scenery alone is worth the trip. Fish are just a bonus. You will see. We will hook them. If not, then I have a, I have a surprise letter for you. All right. <laughs> okay. All right. I got a nice surprise for you. Well, Jim, we're fishing right now for the big guys, for the big tarpon. Uh, we're using that mullet, fishing in the bottom. Very important, is just keep the line free spool. Okay. If, when a fish hit it, just give it free spool. Count to one, two, three, and then point and reel. Point and reel, no, point and reel, no, don't, no don't set, set hook. the hook. We're using circle hooks. Just let it go. And when he jumps, prepare to make a bow. Very, very important. The far as you can, the better it will be. Okay. And then hold on, because we're going to be a good fight. Very good one. Got that? It'll be a good fight. <laughs> oh, that's fine. He got me around the boat. Okay, remember, he jumps, you have to go all the way forward, don't reel. Really. Nice job, buddy. <laughs> you held on to him, Larry. Very cool one. To the left side, left side. Where he goes? Bow, bow. <laughs> Get the bow. Okay, bow. I need you straight forward. Straight forward. Okay. Straight forward. Oh yeah. I don't think so. You know, jump. You take jump. No, no, no. Go forward. No, no, no. Oh. Oh. Come off. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See the bow 
over there. Oh, we did it. We did bow. We did bow perfectly. The first two times I didn't bow. Perfectly. Oh. Oh, 70 pounder fish. Oh, man. The next morning, we met up with Armando's brother, Captain Kareem Char. Now, let's catch some tarpon, okay? Rolling, okay, tarpon, we're gonna throw light bait, light anchovies, okay? What we're gonna do is natural presentations. So when the fish hits, the only thing you're gonna do is just point and reel. Sometimes, he'll take it, and he'll hook himself up, okay? He'll start peeling line out, so. The only thing you have to do is just wait for the jump and just bow to the king, what we call this. Just drop the rod down, give him a minute. Whoa. Hey, oh. hey, okay, be ready, okay, for the jump. You know what you Walk slowly, okay? And then go down a reel, okay, sir? There you go, that's a pretty big, that could be a good slope. Okay, pump to the left side now, sir. Nice, Larry. That was quick. Good. We're the first, magic, buddy. First fish yesterday, first fish today. Oh, oh, good snook. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Now he's going to run. Good job, sir. Man, this is a I think I have a big old stick on there. Is that what it is? A stick? That's a Puerto Rican snook. Puerto Rican stick. <laughs> All right, here you come. He's coming to his boat. Yeah. You think he's going to be through or he's going to make another run? I think he's just going for another run. You know, he's like a red fish, huh? Yeah, he's pretty like, good. He's going to take a little drag. Right. He's coming up. Is that the leader right there, the red? Yep, that's what really is. You see, he was trying to go back to his house, uh -huh. where you hooked him up. They yeah, usually are, uh, well, they, you go back they like and, structures, you know? So they tend to go back to the structure where you, uh, you hook him. So when we release it, we'll let him go, he can go back to the house. Go to the left side. Oh, man, nice look. Wow, that's a monster, man. Oh, my gosh. Oh. Holy cow, man. Can bring the camera in the morning? Man, good job, Larry. I got mine. Damn. Woo! Nice. Pretty nice size, I can tell you that. Better than average. Oh, man. Snug. Check that out, man. Puerto Rican snow. Okay. All right, that has made my trip right there, buddy. God. Look at him out. <laughs> magic tarpon. <laughs> wow. Fairly magic. <laughs> yeah, your man's tarpon. Yeah. yeah. Cool. No, that's a lady fish. This is a good snook, sir. He got a really good trophy there, buddy. Go for the jump, okay? Pump to the right. Pump to the right. Pump to the right. Pump to the right. Pump to the There you go again. Go again. Go again. There we go. Okay. You don't have me? As Armando said, I was fishing on credit. Nice. Got my tarpon for the day. First Wait. fish of the day of tarpon. Definitely bigger than the one I caught yesterday. Yes, sir. I'm ready to bow. I know he's going to make a jump. Yeah. You know, it's a little bigger tackle than yesterday. I think we're going about four pounds more of line. Yeah. And uh, definitely feel the difference. I'm loving it, though. This is a good fight. I tell you. Tell you what, this is kind of compares to is like a triple tail. You just that that steady pull. Uh, oh, this is great. Oh, uh, uh, you did it, Scott. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. Having some fun here in Puerto Rico. Yes, sir. Oh, I was sure as a snook because he hit and he went straight to the bottom. Oh yeah. <laughs> All right, he got that breath of air, a little more energy. Uh, I'm gonna bring it back. Nope, nope. I was gonna bring it back here, but he wants to go the other way. All right, straight up. You just thought that, so. All right. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. 
Yeah, he went straight to the bottom and, and he was coming at us, so I didn't think I had a good fish. And then he made that run. And once he made that run, that was cool. All right. There he is right there. Okay, welcome to day two, the Cabela Saltwater Series here in Puerto Rico. We're having some fun today. Today we're out with Captain Karim and uh, he put us on a big snook tarpon. Man, today's starting out good. The sun hadn't even come up over the trees yet. Let's get him back in the water. <laughs> Come on down! Oh, it's gonna run. It's way too early. You ready? Good job! Good job! You knew it was coming, didn't you? Yep, you know when it's coming. That jump comes, man. You better bow. That's exactly what he said. That scares you, too. You don't know if you're gonna lose that fish or not. Look at that, baby. It's my second tarpon in Puerto Rico. He's small, but that's all right. We're going for big ones in just a little bit. Get us warmed up on these guys. We're just sitting here trolling down the down the mangroves, man. It's about a 12 foot of water. Yeah, around 12 foot. And uh, these anchovies, just they just work themselves, and the, uh, the tarpon take care of the rest. Like the for a few more tarpon, guys. Catch you right back. There he is, there he is, there he is. Woo, this is a fun one. Come here, buddy, I'm gonna turn your head. Get you coming to the boat. Finally. Finally, I got it done right this time. Boy, it is tough. You know, my first instinct is to reel, set a hook. You do that here and you can kiss this fish goodbye. Oh. Woo! <laughs> All right, he's coming in right now. I want you to look at this rod. Dude, no, 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 no. Oh, there he's on, there he's on. There's a rabbit. Larry, awesome, man. Are you going through the police oh, going? Oh, I'm trying to get away from the motor. You going to the motor? <laughs> he's good, he's good. Woo! Where'd he go? Where'd he go? He's on the other side of the boat. Uh, real, real, real. He's just jumping the other side. Oh, really? <laughs> there he is. Oh, oh! <laughs> that was a king. There he goes. That's some Woo! Jim, it's your turn, man. Me and Larry are back on the board. That's it. There you go. Ooh, oh, he almost, ooh, had, he almost had him, Scott. Come on, baby. Come on, lift him, buddy. Lift him. I'm going to put you back in the water, I promise. <laughs> oh. Lift him. Oh, now see, now you're just being a show off. <laughs> 30 years experience. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, <laughs> see man, that's an honor. I'm getting my father-in-law's fish. Hey, what did it, what did it pull it out for me, man? <laughs> Look at this. Is that fun or what? I thought you had more fun than I did. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> I want another one, man. Okay. <laughs> it's Jim's turn. Nice fish. Nice fish. There he goes. Alright, I saw a leader here. Let me know what he Okay. 
Here we go, there we go. Let's see here. He's ready. He's ready. Let the jump. Let the jump. Oh, he almost came in the boat. <laughs> almost, didn't almost. he? Almost. Almost came in the boat. That's a bigger fish than you've been catching. Uh -huh. Look at that. Woo! About 12 pounder, 10, 12 pounder fish. Yeah, that's a lot. You nice see what I'm telling you? One time you hook the fish, you bring it next to the boat, take it easy. Usually you lose your fish, about 60% of the time you lose the fish, it's next to the boat. So take it easy and enjoy it. Well, guys, we had some fun. We caught tarpon, snook. I had no idea we were going to catch snook. Only thing we didn't catch was, I don't know. We caught everything <laughs> you guys said we were going to catch, right? Definitely. Well, guys, thank you so much. All right, we're going to go grab some Puerto Rican food. We'll see you all next week. Accommodations for the Cabela Saltwater Series were provided by Hotel La Playa. Hotel La Playa is a quiet boutique hotel located on the sandy beaches of San Juan. With clean, comfortable rooms and the relaxing atmosphere, it was a perfect hotel for our trip. Hi, and welcome to Cabela's. 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 With MagicTarpon.com. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Fishing with Team of the Year, Mark Otto and Chris Corter. Corter. Coulter. All right, Coulter. here we go. Ready? Hi, and welcome to the Gabe Hi, and welcome to the Gabella Saltwater Series. I am getting tongue twisted, dude. Hi, and where are you looking? Hi, and welcome to Gabella's. I can't say that. Ready? I'm waiting on you. Fishing with Team of the Year, Chris Coter. God dang! There we go. Can I just say Chris Colter? Colter? Colter. 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 Fishing. <laughs> <laughs> Can't say it, man. Uh, series. Today we're in San Juan. What? <laughs> what the <laughs> this? Hi, and welcome to. <laughs> and we're fishing with Team of the Year. <laughs> Dude, I'm done. I'm wrong. Colton, I got it wrong. <laughs> Hi, and welcome to the Cabela's Bleh. Team of the Year, Mark Otto and Chris Coter. <laughs> God dang! From Puerto Rico, San Juan. <laughs> I have already forgot what I'm saying now. You jacked me up, man. Don't, you better get it right, because I ain't doing this again. And welcome to the Cabela's Saltwater Series. Sorry, that was wrong, dude. <laughs> Today we're in... <laughs> Hi, and welcome to the Cabela's... Dude! Relax, relax yourself. To the <laughs> 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 he got it already. God dang. Okay, I'm done. We'll do it later. I can't get it. Closed captioning provided by Wade Ride by Coastal Fishing Gear. If you would like to find out more information about the Cabela's Saltwater Series tournaments, including the Cabela's Redfish Series, Redfish Anglers Association Tour, Mayak Owners Tournament, or Texas Kids Series. Visit www.saltwaterseries.com or like us on Facebook.